these vehicles. It's a new type of vehicle and it's, it's very advanced. The troops, the soldiers, will definitely be protected and um, we have less casualty. The exercise we're having, which is codenamed Exercise Star Ride, is the final exercise for the participants of the Army War College Course 7. In a bid to aid the military fight against insurgency, the headquarters Nigerian Army Corps on Supply and Transport has organized a two-week intensive training for its personnel to effectively use the newly acquired tight mice protective vehicles for operations. It's running modes, everything is on the is sure. Declaring the workshop open, the chief of training army, ably represented by the director of training, said the Nigerian army has recently acquired some trans mine protective vehicles which will aid military fight against terrorism. To be able to use these vehicles effectively, the Nigerian army has drawn drivers all over formations of the Nigerian army to have a two weeks intensive training on these vehicles. I enjoy all the participants to take this training very seriously because most of you, or all of you, will go back to your various formations to train other drivers. The basis of the training is just, uh, the Nigerian just acquired this new, new variant of the vehicles and the vehicle is a mine protective vehicle which protects the troops from explosions and the rest of it. And one of our major problems in the notice in the fight against terrorism is um, the explosive. So with this vehicle, it is clear that um, the troops, the soldiers, we definitely be protected and um, we have less casualty while prosecuting the fight against um, terrorism. And the essence of this training is just to give the users, which are the passengers, the soldiers, a first time feel of those vehicles because they will be the one to conduct and use those vehicles in the fight against terrorism. Okay. The, the essence of the vehicle is it's a mine protected vehicle to protect your personnel, troops, drivers, everybody there. And the essence of this training session is to get the people familiar with these vehicles. It's a new type of vehicle and it's, it's very advanced. So we want to get the, the most out of the, the vehicle itself and to keep the people safe inside there. You have got that there. It is just a different type of vehicle. It's smaller, it's faster, more, more powerful. But uh, it's, it's yes, it will be two days lectures, two days presentations, just to get them familiar with it. And then we're going to move on to practical, where the people can learn what the vehicle is capable of. There's going to be a lot of driving, different situations, uh, tarred road, dirt road, sandy conditions, muddy conditions, that they can get familiar with the vehicles. All right. Spy TV News reports on August this year that Nigerian Army received batch of vehicles from Saudi Arabia. The vehicle was seen in Port Harcourt. It offers superior mobility in a wide range climatic condition 
and it serves diverse roles in urban and peacekeeping operations. Meanwhile, the Army War College Nigeria has started a strategic military exercise codenamed Exercise Star Ride, designed to equip participants of Army War College Course 7 2023 with the skills and knowledge necessary to effectively respond to contemporary security challenges facing the nation. We have sector 1, sector 2 and sector 3. Sector 1 headquarters and sector 3 is in Mungunu. So the aim is for us to finally fight the terrorists in the general area of Northeast and push them out finally so that we begin to develop our Northeast region as directed by the President of the Republic of Nigeria. It's on this note that the Chief of Defense Staff as it should is uh, planning directive to ensure that the terrorists are pushed out of this general area. Some bishop forest and the the chat basin and other for more. Operation Mountain Science was also launched on first uh, June 2023 to clear the Madara Mountains of the soil. Speaking to journalists on Monday, the Commandant Army War College, Nigeria said the exercise which integrates various aspects of national security, inter-agency coordination, logistic planning, counter-terrorism and stabilization operations represent the combination of the extensive training packages uh, offered by the college. Uh, the exercise we're having which is codenamed exercise star ride is the final exercise for the participants of the Army War College Course 7. And the exercise is designed to practice the participants on all they have learned during the period of the course from the beginning all through till date. For impacts that it will bear across the country, well, it's just as I've said earlier, on leaving the college, the participants will be more than operations tested to be deployed in any of the operation. And having acquired the skills that they require to perform their duties effectively, whether as commanders or staff officers, then they will not but function very, very effectively when found uh, in those appointments on leaving the college. The exercise reflects the Army War College in Nigeria's dedication to developing leaders who can work collaboratively across different agencies and domains to safeguard national security. The exercise is expected to finish tomorrow, 26 September 2023, providing participants with intensive training and practical experience that will shape them into effective leaders capable of addressing national security with confidence and competences. Olayemi Esso for Spy TV.